Peace be upon you. Today you are going to reveal together what is environment variables, what is pass variables for executable files, what is the difference between system variable and user variables, how to find first of all the environment variables editor using graphical user interface from the search. You can cite envi, in NVI for example, and then you will find edit the system environment variable, double click. As you can see, we have system properties, and from the system properties, we check advanced tab. From advanced tab, we have environment variables. Click it. Now we have the environment variables tab. As you can see, we have user variable and system variable. What is the difference between them? The only difference is that for system variables, anything is located here will be global and shareable between all the users they are using that PC. For user variables, it means that only the current user who is running this PC are going to have access to these variables related to his user account only and that's for privacy purposes and for private use only depend on the project where you are working on you can use user variable or you can use system variable so what is environment variables environment variables are set of dynamic named values that can affect the any way of running process which means that you can here identify variable name and give it a value then later on depends on your programming language or the application of your choice you can target this variable name to extract and to use the value of this variable by this way you can dynamically change this value without affecting your application on production or in development you can you set a new system variable from here you can find new whether it's user or system new let's for example set edge as microsoft edge to check it as a system variable i'm going to set edge as my edge home this is a pattern we are using it usually when we set up environment variable for some kind of application we write the application name underscore then home and in home we are going to give a value of where is the home folder of edge application from here microsoft edge right click open file location and here we are we have application this is the home folder of my edge copy it and only here paste now i have a system variable of edge home with value of the home application of edge okay and another okay to save the value and then we will open the command line let's consider command line is the application of our choice at the moment and from the command line i'm going to check by using just echo then percentage then writing edge home enter as you can see now i have the variable name edge home and i have the variable value which means that later on depends on the programming language of your choice you can use only this variable name to target this variable value some of the application to run smoothly in your pc they need already to find specific kind of variables name that's also one of the reason why sometimes you need to set variables because this application will work only when it's find this variables name by the button which this application required that we are going to reveal and speak about when we start setting up our environment variable for some of the most famous programming languages such as java or NGS or etc how can now we use the path for executable edge application i write here ms edge enter i will get this message that edge ms edge is not recognized as internal or external command which means that i need somehow to tell the command line where to find the executable file of ms edge from here we have pass this pass is mean the location of the executable file for the specific application we would like to use it in command line from here edit i know that i need to use edge as my running application from command line i will add just new then i'm going to add edge home backslash and i need now to identify where is the folder to find the executable file for edge for example from edge again i will go back to application i know that edge is storing the executable file inside this folder i will take it copy after the backslash just pass now i have identified for the path where to find the executable file related to edge application in the future it doesn't make different what kind of application you would like to use from the command line you will use the same exact method okay then another okay then let's have a test using the command line ms 
Edge Enter. As you can see, MS Edge already opened in my application using the command line, not using the icon which I have it on my desktop. That's how can we use pass, how can we use environment variables, and the difference between user variables and system variables. In the future, we are going to continue setting up our environment for development using some of programming language which daily use or depends on your need. So see you soon for next one. Be tuned. Peace be upon you.